Hello everyone, Warwolf back here again. Finally starting my schedule off and me is Throwback Thursday. So we are going to be playing Majesty Gold HD this today. Um, I used to play this a long time ago in... I don't know. I used to live with my parents and I used to play this on Windows 95. It was a long time ago. And... It was probably one of my favorite games of the time. Um, it's a little difficult because of how the characters in the game work, which you will see in a minute here. Uh, this, but this game came out in, I believe, uh, 2000, so it's been 19 years now. It's quite a bit old. But let's get started right on this. And let's see. They're suggesting we do the bell, the book, and a candle for the introduction book. Don't mind my mouse here, for some reason it's goofing up right now. So let's see. That's right, I gotta do it. Like this, alright. Bell, the book, and a candle. Forgive the intrusion, Highness, but we've been robbed! Someone has stolen the magic bell, the holy book, and the eternal candle! Right from under our noses, they were whisked away from the royal treasury by some scoundrel! We must do something to recover them! They are treasures beyond value! Okay, goals. Recover three items which have been stolen from your palace and put in layers throughout the realm. There's gonna be three, um, palaces, I guess. Quote for quote palaces. That are around the map. Um, I have to find them and destroy them and collect the bell, the book, and the candle. I'm not allowed to use warriors or wizards. Let's see, okay. There are rumors that these thieves who stole artifacts from your treasury have fled but were forced to hide the artifacts as they left. Find the items before the thieves have a chance to return. It was really goofy how this works because this isn't the same as it was on Windows 95. I don't think, uh, I don't remember exactly what the controls are either. It's been a long time since I've played this game. Heroes visit the blacksmith in order to purchase better weapons armor. Once you have researched those skills, upgrade your blacksmith and even better items will be available for your research. Guard houses host a member of the city guard and can fire arrows at nearby enemies. Since you research that skill, use them to protect vital buildings or far-flung outposts of your city. Henchmen also rest at guard houses if they are closer than the palace. Your Highness, if our kingdom is to prosper, it needs more heroes. Yeah, yeah, I'll build in a minute. The inns are gathering and resting places for heroes and allow them to extend the range of their wandering if you build them outside your main city. Okay, let's start building. So, let's get a few gnomes in here. Gnomes are really good for, um, building. They're not very strong or anything, but usually there's three gnomes per gnome hovel. And, uh, they will kind of upgrade themselves, I guess. Let's start, uh, let's also do a ranger's gill. Ranger, they like to go and explore, so. Your Majesty, a new building is complete. Your Highness, if our kingdom is to prosper, it needs more heroes. Oh, I'm working on it, right? Majesty, the local blacksmith offers new services. Your Majesty, a I new building is complete. Pleasure. Majesty, the local blacksmith okay, so offers new our, services. Our, Your Majesty, a new building is complete. So I'm hoping to have this done in about 12 days. Let's go over to this. Trading posts are placed for heroes to purchase healing potions, build a marketplace near your palace, and the trading posts will periodically send caravans to them. 
bring in a bunch of gold to your treasury. Alright, so it's probably gonna market like this. Sovereign! A building has been upgraded! Up. This is all controlled by the mouse, but the screen apparently isn't uh the same size. Where can I place this thing? Right there. My tax collector. Where's the gold? Oh, the money. A Medusa. Sovereign, a building has been but upgraded. Your Majesty, a new no. building is complete. I don't like losing the gnomes. Alright, your phone will the keep and the missing candle so I keep any recovery. I join the wild spirits. Majesty, the local blacksmith offers new services. No level up fast, but I think I hit once, I'm pretty much done. I feel up, man. I feel revitalized. I'm out of here. Majesty! The local blacksmith offers new I services. Revitalized. Sovereign, your marketplace now serves you better. Revitalized. I feel revitalized. I join the wild spirit. I feel revitalized. Sovereign, your marketplace now serves you better. Where's the gold? Sovereign, a building has been upgraded. has been upgraded. Majesty, the local blacksmith offers new services. Sovereign, a building has been upgraded. Sovereign, your marketplace now serves you better. Your Highness, we've improved the guardhouse. Majesty, the local blacksmith offers new services. Your Highness, we've improved the guardhouse. Well, as you can see, things get upgraded quick, so it's not like these first couple levels are out. Uh, Sovereign, a building has been upgraded. Let's, let's do an for right here. Let's do a nice corner, and since nobody's been up here, we'll go in that corner also. Always one of these. Eternal 
candle, he gets increased sight range. All right. What a delicious looking reward. Oh, do I go for you there, Mr. Sticky Fingers? But at least you're upgrading. Or you go use the upgrade. Your trading post now offers healing potions! I'm really hoping to shoot for about 12 days. I don't think I'm going to be able to do it though. This is what I mean though, where these characters in this game. Sovereign, your marketplace now serves you better. So you gotta help them out. I'll give them the rewards and the robes. Nobody missed this. Very good at that. Like this guy, he's holding a decent amount of money right now. He's got 840 gold, so I'm hoping that he's gonna go and spend it somewhere. Ah! Where I can get it back. Um. They all gain experience by doing a little exploration. The rangers, they like to do that on their own anyway, but... Leave my gold alone. The palace renovations are finished! Tax collector! Come on, man. This guy's just going exploring. Father Crossbow, and well, he doesn't have any money though. Maybe if he would go and explore. Vicinity and they just try that, he's gonna get part of the 
Glorious, your majesty! The bell, book, and candle are back in their rightful place. We also found the thief who stole them from the castle, a rogue identified as Cherik of Keldurn. Unfortunately, he escaped while being returned to the castle, with a 15,000 gold piece reward on his head. I'm sure he'll think long and hard before returning to our kingdom. If he even makes it. 15,000 gold piece reward on Cherik of Keldurn or whatever. I don't think it's going to last very long. Alright guys, anyway, so that was a piece. Just the tutorial of Majesty. One of my older favorite games that I used to play. Um... It took almost close to what I was planning on it taking. I was hopefully shooting for that 12 days on there, but I eventually moved into the 13th day. So, it doesn't matter because I am on high scores anyway. I'm also the only one that has played this game so far. That is it for today, though. Um, I'm going to have a different Throwback Thursday game for you, but I might throw a little bit of this game play in somewhere, maybe on the weekend or the morning or something. I would like to do a few little, a few more little missions. Um, as you can see here, there is quite a few, and some of them I haven't even played. The, uh, the Balance of Twilight, and... No, it's not Legendary Heroes. Let's look at... Um, Darkness Falls, maybe? I don't know. Some of these I have not, never played before because the original game when it came out, there was a... Uh, it ended right here. This was the secret quest. And it just required you to beat all of the missions. In this case, it is all the southern quests. And they have added this section up here. Um, Like I said, that is all for today, folks. This is, uh, this is Majesty. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the bell icon to keep notified when I post videos. And, uh, yeah, I'd like to hear from you guys, so definitely comment. I want to know your thoughts. Um, thank you. We'll see you next time.